motivated to change his life. Yeah, he's not motivated to give me money, to sign a contract, to do business, to make Mrs. Diamond real happy today. Not only that, right, even if you did take him in under your wing, what would he do with people he talks to? What, is he going to text everyone? If he's not going to talk to you, who is he going to talk to? Exactly, you're wasting time, God-given life. I don't want to waste one minute of this precious thing called life. I want to have fun. I want to enjoy life. I want to be a. I don't want to be a participant, not a spectator. Okay. I don't want to. You know how much time you waste in life with people. You. Why are we in business? To make money. When? Today. You may never leave out the today part. That's the most important part, Kyle. We are in business to make money today. And if someone is not willing to get on the phone with a nice guy like you or me, I'll help them. I'll answer their questions, okay? But if I can't qualify them, if I can't ask questions, if I can't determine whether or not I'm just doing free consulting, and this is a guy who's going to pick my brain so he can beat the shit out of somebody else, what's the point? Yeah. I'm in business to make money today, get a contract today, or fire him today. Yeah. I can't. I can't do that texting and emailing back and forth. I. You can disagree with me. Com, you can disagree with me, but I feel very strongly about this. Yeah, yeah. I'm. I'm getting that more with some people. They. They don't. They're very. They're not used to talking on the phone. You okay. Know, time to le time to learn, it. man. It's 2018. It's been, This thing's been around for a hundred and something years. Yeah. And it's not going anywhere. It's not going anywhere, and it's getting better and better. This is the remote control device to the universe. So if I can't get them on the phone, I'm firing them politely. Mm. Okay? I mean, when you're interested in a subject or a topic, I mean really interested, you go on Google, you research, you watch videos, you may even call a few people. Hey, I saw your video. Hey, I heard about your program. Hey, uh, your book is available. Do you have my new book, by the way? If not, I I'll... Do. Okay, good. I do. Read it and Thanks. let me know if you like it. Got a lot of role plays in there. Um, it's funny. I didn't, I'm about to jump on that this weekend. Okay, good. Let me take it in the toilet. You'll read three, four rules of the gut sales method. And I tried to make it real short, kind of funny. I make a lot of fun of myself, bad pictures. <laughs> and I got a lot of role plays in there. That's good. That's, that's important. Oh, yeah. Super important. Uh, so I wanted to make it so it's short and you can stop and go anywhere. Just read a rule, stop, then start again and pick up the new rules. Got about, I think there's almost 50 rules in there. Just went to the publisher yesterday, uh, matter wow. of fact. You guys get it early, though. You get it first. When do you think it's, uh, you're putting it out to the um, public? Oh, um, uh, this weekend, if Mr. Mentor, the time. This, it's always about the wow. time. What's the difference between a millionaire and a guy who struggles? He knows how to... Manages time. Yeah. Does the stuff that gets him to the bank today, makes money today. And managing time is, to me, whew, you know, that, that's, the t uh, that's the, a millionaire. Donald Trump has 24 hours just like everyone else. How come he made so much money? He knows how to manage his time. What else? What else is it about him that nobody, nobody notices? I told my students this. What does he do different? from everybody else. What is he doing? What does he do to people? It gets them all so emotional and everything. What is he doing? I think he knows how to push their buttons. Push buttons. That's a good word. Push buttons. Do you think when you push someone's button, do you have their attention? Gets them emotional. Gets them emotional. What are we always talking about? Get people emotional. Get their attention. What's the million dollar rule? Set goes right into it. People make emotional... People make the most important decisions when they're emotional. What did he do in the whole campaign? What's he been he, doing his whole life? Riling people up, getting people excited. Get them excited, get them pissed, get them happy. Uh, he, pick, he, he knows how to get their attention. Attention, yeah. He doesn't need, he didn't, you know, it's an interesting <laughs> thing. Hillary had, I think, a, she had like $150, $200 million for, during her campaign for promotion and everything. Yeah. Trump, I don't think, spent $15, $20 million. How come he spent one-tenth of what she spent, yet he got all the media attention all the time? All the stories were on him. All the stories? He everyone's attention. <laughs> he, was, he, was in England, he was in England today, and 
one of the reporters from CNN, uh, you know, one of the uh, com network co uh, commentators raised his hand and had a question for the president. He says, um, you know what? I don't talk to CNN. <laughs> the guy is, whatever your feelings are, people get real emotional about him, real upset. They love him, hate him. They don't know what to do with him. But who's in control here? He is. What did he do? He went to NATO. There there have you watched the bit they're, they're they don't know how to deal with this guy yeah yeah i don't yeah. know if he's the smartest guy in the world or I, he did good with that nato thing though he did he did i think he did i think he did he, he went in there kicked their of... he kicked their ass and he said we're just going to pull out we don't need you guys and why are we spending all this money on you unless unless of course you want to and i'm going to russia in a few days you know i'll talk to them and they yeah. whoa 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 we'll give you more money Okay. Yeah. Okay. So I'm sorry. Yeah. <laughs> Everyone uh, up there spending. So what's the takeaway that you can learn from this for your business? Um, if I get people emotional, I can get them to make a decision. Yeah. What else? Can you control the process? Can you control the environment? You ever get in a situation where they're just asking you questions, well, and they're not even being nice about it. And they're just asking questions. You're answering questions. Then they dismiss you. Okay, send me your stuff. I'll think about it. Call me in two weeks. And you get off the phone. You say, "Oh man, I'm close. I got one." You don't have shit. Yeah. You didn't. You weren't in control. Yeah. 